Alright, so here we are. Cherry Blossom. Now this course is hard. I think it could potentially be the hardest course in the game. I don't own them all, but I definitely think it's one of the hardest. It's so easy to just make mistakes and then lose two strokes. If you hit this one too hard, for example, you don't hit it hard enough, you don't have a line at the hole. Oh, let's put that one in. All right. Now this one, I think, in order to get it across both in one shot, you have to hit the right edge, bounce off, and go that way. But that's that's a little too much. So we're just gonna push it right across, and then get it across this way. I need to get a little more over. Okay, that's good. I don't want to be on the corner. Now what we have to do is get this up just enough to get up, but not go off. Oh, almost made that one. All right. And that's just a par. All right. Now on this one, we have to hit it hard enough to get it over, but not so hard that it goes over the side. Oh, that was almost too hard. We got lucky, and I think we have a chance at 30. And par 3. Alright. I feel like I'm making it look somewhat easy, but... This is a, this is a tough one. You gotta hit it. I'm hit it hard enough just to get it down there. Ooh, almost a hit hard enough. Now I'm really in a little bit of trouble. I'm going to hit it just enough to where I can have a line at the hole. Did I? Did I? Let's see. Oh, that's a tough one. I did not. So, I'm just going to put it right there and I'm going to take my par and move on. I don't know how anybody would ever make a hole in one on this one, but I'm sure there are ways. Alright. This is a tough one. you got a couple of options, but then you got that sand in the middle. It's actually a little bit of a wider gap than you think, so I like to try and go right through that gap. Did I hit it hard enough? I did not. And then push it out here. Oh, don't go too far. Stop. That was close. See, it's so easy to make mistakes on this course. And here's, this is a difficult one. I'd like to try, just hit it hard enough where I can get it through the gap, maybe? We'll see. Yeah, I should have a line, actually, right at the hole. I might get lucky. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's a, that's a good way to go with that one. Otherwise, you might get stuck having to go all the way around. But, I'm going to tell you right now, it's the first time I've ever done that, see? <laughs> New whole record. So, alright. Now, this was a difficult one. you got to hit it just hard enough to bounce up and go over. Ah, uh, we did well. We did well. I've been stuck down there before three or four times. Can we make it? There we go. Alright, we're alright so far. Four under after seven. Alright, this is a tough one. I don't know if I can get it. And the question is if I can get it to work its way down there, then I have a shot, but the problem is is I'm probably gonna end up down there and then have to come all the way around. But, we could try and see if we can, nope, nope, 
Oh, now you're stuck going all the way down there, aren't you? See? Small little mistakes. But I should be able to get this one. Up the nope. Alright, we should be able to get it all the way down to the hole. Stop. Okay. I don't know if that's a... Oh, this would be a par if we make it. Okay. So you can see where you can make some little mistakes. Yeah, par three. Oh, stop. Oh, see? I can't. I just gotta knock it over here. I hit it too far. And then just put the ball up there right by the hole. Take our bogey and move on. So, pretty tough. Alright. Now, I don't know the secret sauce to this one. So, I'm just going to go over here to this guy. So you got to get it in there at least. So where are you going to pop it down there? This one goes over here. So I do think I want to go in this one. And then let's see if we can tell which hole goes where. One, that one pops out over there. This one probably pops out over here. Yeah. Let's just go to the middle one there. And then this one might actually drop in the hole. If it goes in right. Oh! Mm. Yeah, part eight. Okay. So this should be for Eagle? Yeah. I don't know what the trick is to that one, but I don't have it. Alright. So the idea here is, what I like to do is I kind of, kind of like to take a little. I like to try and stop it somewhere back over there, right? So that I can then put it down here to this level. And I'll show you what I mean. So, just get it past the, just get it past the edge, like right there, right? Now, I actually have a shot at making it because I can put it here, bounce it off there. Oh, just needed to bounce it off higher. But now, see, we don't mess around with any of this potential stuff. Take our par. You know, I had a chance at birdie. Get on out of here. Alright, so this one we gotta bounce. I guess we gotta gauge the speed right. Oh, too much. Not enough, and then just right. Nope. Oh. Okay. Ooh, par three. So double bogey. Ooh, triple. That hurts. Alright, see, see how the, whew, see how the stakes work? Alright, now, I mean, this is a part two, so, I think if we just hit it straight, we're okay. Let's 
Okay. Make our par. Get out of here. Nice. Okay, so see this one's, this is dangerous. There's no water to go down to the hole now. You have no choice but to make it in here. So, let's do it. You've got to be kidding me. And apparently you have to hit it hard enough to get it through. Wow. Such a precise shot. Finally. Oh, yeah. Let's see where this puts us. Well, I think our only shot is potentially to bang it through and hopefully get lucky with some ricochets. Which we did not. Whew. Okay. I'll the way back down to minus one. We're still on the par, though. Now, here's the question. The only way I think we can do this is to use the bounce just right on the right-hand side. Nope. Hit it too hard. All right. Kick off, come back. Par three. You say par. Okay, barely. Alright, only 16. So, I think a little trick here is to hit it a little hard and get it bouncing. Okay. All right. Hey, that, that didn't turn out too bad. Oh, we almost had even a shot at the green at the hole, but I just want to put it up close enough to get it in there for our birdie. So I think the key there is to bounce it. Otherwise, you know, it's difficult to get a birdie. All right. So this obviously has to go with the right amount of pace. So let's try it. And okay, okay, okay. All right. All right. Stop. Okay. <laughs> I don't even feel like it came off the bricks. Right for this hole. All right. Oh, this is another one we want to try and get hopping. So let's see. Let's see if we can do it. Nope. Okay. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. So I think the trick here is to hop it on the edge. Okay. And then now, we have to hit it hard enough to hop it over. Yep. Oh, actually, that's probably not the... Not the way we wanted to do it. So, alright. Hop this bad boy on the edge. And then I think what we want is to get it out here. And then we want to hop it. Alright, double straw. I was trying to go over there, but, yep. We could just, alright, where's our double? 
Yep. Max strokes. Alright. I'm still uh, Okay. Alright. See? This is tough. I have no idea how I have a course record of, of minus six, as you can see. <laughs> it's a tough course. It's a really tough course. I think it's probably one of the hardest ones out here. So anything under par is great on this course. You know, I'm sure there's a lot of people out there who have shot like I don't know, 20 under or something stupid because they know all the tricks and they play this game. But, you know, I build these videos for, you know, beginners, amateurs, whatever you want to call them that, you know, don't play it a whole lot. And, uh, you know, so you can kind of see the course, formulate a little bit of a strategy. But, you know, you're not playing this game six hours a day. So, all right. That's it. Thanks for watching.